My friends, welcome back to the Borg Collective. This is episode 2. Hope you're enjoying yourself. Episode 1 um, was actually uh, quite nice. That we, You could see that it takes some time to unlock a, uh, a few certain options. We also uh, got the pyramid uh, in our research tab. Let's uh, be honest about that. <laughs> um, let's go here. The first one that we're going to be taking is of course the colony harvesting. The second one is going to be administrative cap plus 20. So that's one. We don't need anything else at the moment. Uh, we could increase the yield and we could increase the nanites, the army upkeep less, the ship cost and all of that good stuff. But we don't need it. Um, as for this, there, I believe there is a administrative cap in here somewhere as well. Um, let me take a quick look. Monthly administrative cap. So that's going to be the very first Ascension perk that we will select. Um, everything to keep our research cost down. And the nutrients are still nutrients and are annoying us. I kind of want to take this one, even though it will get us over our naval, uh, our Empire Sprawl. I feel that we need it. I need it. Naval uh, Depots. Um, this is still for spheres, bioreactions, can't do anything with it. So let's go for the fabrication complex. This construction ship is not doing anything and is probably not going to do anything until we go to war with these guys. And they've been boosting their um, stations and their stations are going to be strong. A lot stronger. Wow, it's raining really hard. <laughs> oh, my wife is going to be soaked when she gets home from work. That's very unfortunate. Um, let's take this one. Let's do the research station. And now we have two places where we can actually start making our star bases. Now you are getting upgraded, which is a good thing. And now in this system, let's upgrade you as well. We have plenty of alloys. We have plenty of it. Look at this. Almost at the cap of our energy. Now we don't want that. We don't want to be at our cap. Um, at first glance, the planet does seem capable of supporting life, uh, living beings. But nevertheless, we have detected signs of um, emanating from somewhere beneath the siphon. Okay, great. Well, whatever. Let's see. So these are building now. Um, do we need a second? You know, the pyramids will take a long time to get built. And it, it's just going to be worse every time <laughs> oh boy oh boy the construction times of uh, of your cube <laughs> oh, oh wow that that is something else i can tell you that that really is something else uh, once these are done we're going into naval cap i'm actually considering just building the um the naval depot over here and then doing the naval logistics center because we want to start boosting this fleet you know, we want to get it up to uh, about 8 and then have a few pyramids. Uh, but for now, we're just going to keep it the way it is until we get the pyramids. Get a sip of water. Because I feel a cough coming up. I don't want that. Oh, yeah. Love it. So, we don't particularly need the resources. Let me be honest about that. Um, we're just going to be trading them away. That's what we will do with them. How long until the pyramids? The pyramids is going to take us a uh, hundred months. A hundred months. Do you see how much of a problem with a empire spot? It gives. It's only a zero point sixty, right? Zero point sixty. A hundred months. Damn. 112 for the next one and we're going for a simulation unit complex is up to maximum of three and then we're going for the administrative cap i don't know which way to be focusing on i know there's a comment saying in which order i should go and do my um traditions so i'll definitely have to take a look off camera do that one this is going to be nice this is going to be really nice especially with the pyramid coming in uh, the scientist is not doing anything. And that's always a mistake. Go here, survey that, please. Hey, what's going on over here? Research that project first, then go over there. Uh, please click this button, guys. Surveying. It, 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 it truly, it isn't too difficult. It's too many people don't do it. It's, it's a shame. You just have to click, oh, and hold, shift. 
you know, that's it. Shift. Shift is the way to go. Let shift be your friend. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, let's see. How are you building up? So, zero, zero available jobs. Um, you were going to be uh, in my alloy. My alloy foundry. And most likely nanite. Nanite's plus 14. That is not something to be uh, writing home about. I, I do hope you're not hearing the rain. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, you are probably. Oh, what can you do? Um, I would like to get both of these. Now, 16 and 8 is not too much, but let's do this one first and then the nanites. How about you? You're still building up. There's no need to do anything with you. Habitability over here, no jobs available. There's no reserve drones yet. Um, we don't need the amenities at the moment. Uh, we don't need the officer jobs. Um, the hive node is kind of interesting because it does give some growth speed. But once again, growth speed is not so important. So let's just make sure that we get more energy. As for you, you are going to be housing and... Oh, we're at war! Oh, we're at war! <laughs> oh, you dumbass. Oh, that is going to be bad. Okay, well, okay, but we'll, I guess we're not waiting for the pyramids. We're not... Um, let's just see what will happen. Let's go to you. Let's increase you up to 8. Like I said, try uh, on Grand Admiral, you don't want to have your ships down too much. Firing rate, plus 5. Yeah, why not? 9 of 12. Yeah, you need to jump away. Man, look at this. Uh, why aren't you jumping? Two days, and the ship is lost. Of course the ship is... Oh, okay, it jumped away. It did jump. Which is fine. Very first war has been declared on us. And I had, was worried that I had to do that all by myself. Okay. Oh, well, what can you do? Let's get naval logistics centers up and running. Um, you. You need some naval depots. And then get a naval logistics. You get naval logistics. Yeah, we're going to boost this thing out of the wazoo. A few more months. We're not in a rush. We're not in a rush. Even though some do believe so. We're going to aim for these three planets. And we're going to harvest them. Let them attack if they want to attack. They, um, I don't think they will attack. And we need to be a lot stronger. In order to get close to these bases. Because they are quite strong. I believe the one over here is 1.4. Hey, this one's been done. That is great. That is great. Let's see, where are you? Mul uh, maturing chamber. Let's make sure that's up and running. Giving you a, um, a Borg assembly speed of 4 instead of 2. How oh, about you do have 3? No, we definitely have jobs available. So we don't want to mess with that just yet. We're making 23 alloys now. And we are doing 21 in terms of nanites. We're boosting our power. And then our equivalent. Sue for peace. There will be no peace. <laughs> oh no. Not yet. Not yet. 9 of 12 is ready. And able. We definitely want to harvest a, a world. Harvest one planet would be so nice. And we are going to. We're going to be attacking into this direction. I wonder if they will attack me. I've, I've heard there was a problem at the moment. At the moment of recording, it could very well be that the AI is a bit wonky. Um, but it, 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 will be, it will be fixed. We know that. Uh, let's see. Technologies. Naval capacity is definitely boosted. Fleet command limit. 
Yeah, I'm actually quite interested in that. Uh, let's go for the fleet command limit. Because I want to boost it up to... Uh, it was 30, right? Technology. 40. And we can definitely build a few pyramids. Which is 20 months. So let this tick. Let this tick. We will attack one of the systems. So um, <laughs> they will lose the war. Uh, it will bring us, however, over the naval cap. Which is a tiny bit of a problem. Um... Yeah, let's send you downwards as well then. At least we um, we will not encounter the Volf. And that is definitely a great thing. Because the Volf are annoying. Let's see, do we want to boost some more? I kind of do. I kind of do. Mm, the scientist is not doing anything. How, how is that possible? How, how are you not surveying this? And researching that. Let's see. Send you up there. Here. But just, but just send it into a random direction. It's uh, not a big deal. Now look at them snakes. Staking the way out of it. Gorgeous. Like it. Really do like that. Uh, let's wait until we have all eight. And we'll attack this planet. It's probably not... Interesting enough to harvest. Probably. And the main reason is of course that um, it, it probably has like four four people living there. Shall, shall we actually attack? Shall we just let this war tick? There's no point in harvesting something that has no real value in harvesting. Let's go to Bentos with our fleet. We get some, a little bit of physics there, which is definitely nice. So let's pause here. Let's see if we go there. It will go there. Okay, so I want to move you over to Bentos. Okay, you're done. We're on 64. Status quo is on 40. I, yeah, okay. They they are fast with the um, the declaration of war. Even though the AI is aggressive. Is, is, oh, wow. Aggressiveness is on, uh, on normal. And let them snake, let them snake. We'll, uh, we'll build some more unit complexes over here as soon as we need them. Now, you are over here currently. Let's pause here. But if you, I send you there, still going to Mecca. I don't want, I don't want that system. Is there a way for us to... Okay, the current population is 11. Can we see that from orbit? No, we'll have to go in here. 12? 11 might not be as bad. Okay, let, let's be on the aggressive side then. Let's be passive. Let's be passive. I'll attack. I'll, I'll tell them where to attack. Ooh, look at this. This is bad. This is bad. We don't want that. Uh, bye. How long has that been? I hope not too long. I hope not too long. Well, me being me, it's been probably been ages. 2.2k, man, these stations are insane. Sensor echoes have indicated the presence of some kind of unidentified object deep within the atmosphere of this gas giant. Oh no. The pyramid's been done. <laughs> Great. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Let's see. Oh, four. Let's get this resource out of the way. Let's go. Two. Oh, the cone. Go away. I don't like the cone. We'll not get the cone. Never. But. Do we want to have it like that? Uh, hell, uh, no. Of course, we're going to have these weapons on there. It is okay-ish. Evasion plus four, chance to evade. Tracking. Tra yeah, definitely the tracking. Uh, warp speed plus 55. Damn, that is quite nice. That really is nice. They're fast. So, here's the cone. Yeah, we won't buy it. We will never buy it. Um, as for you, the pyramid. The pyramid is absolutely amazing. I love the pyramid. Do we want to have heavy torpedoes or superiority? Well, we're basically going to see what is going to be the most damage for us. Um, you. Let's flip these weapons. And the rest is all the same. It's 47. How about you? 
Um, this is the... Okay, we can't change it. So this is superiority and the pyramid. Fine. Uh, I'll name it pyramid superiority and, and whatever. This is... Tr the tracking is quite nice. I do like that. Inertial dampers we don't need. Evasion plus four. Chances to evade. No, we don't need that. EPS, that's your weapon's damage. But why don't we use this one? So the weapon's range. The damage is a bit less. Actually, no. Let's just keep it like this. Uh, living armor. That's armor. Look at these. Look at this. 9,000. Ship hull points. Also very nice. Engineering station. Emergency force fields. It's so strong. So 47. Or let's go for the heavy torpedoes. Because oh, they probably won't have anything to counter that. And I'm thinking um, oh, we're going to be torpedo. Torpedo heavy. We... we uh, this is your point defense. Okay. Two point defense. A lot of torpedoes. 47.9. Actually. Look. This one does have six point defense weapons. That's how I'm seeing it. Six point defense. Cutting beams. Um, heavy damage and torpedoes. So why would I go to the space superiority pyramid? I don't need it right now. What I need is damage. I like damage. Auto upgrade go is there anything else ship weapon damage plus 10 yes i do like that transwarp let's see there is this one is special sublight speed or oh, repairing the uh, the friendly ships in range chances to hit negative four why why Oh, this is an effect on hostile ships. So the hostile ships have a negative 4 on hitting. And a, I do like the sublight speed. Make them slow. Make sure they can't... Actually, it makes no point. It, it, it makes a point when you're having like uh, battleships that are really slow. And corvettes that are really fast. And making them slower, your battleships will be able to hit them more. For now, I'm actually leaning on, on getting this one. On the chances to hit. Negative 4. It doesn't do anything else. In terms of. It actually boosts. Yeah definitely. Let's go for the. For the. Um, the electronic counter. Countermeasures. Why can't I not save this. Ship already. Des uh, designed thing. Okay great. Uh, the rest didn't change. So, in terms of fleet. Now, we, we are not... Look, they, they bypassed the, the system, which is great. Will our construction ship do the same? No, because of this one. Let's get the uh, anomaly in the system. Okay. Uh, let's research that. We have not... Then nothing is nothing is coming in at the moment, so I'm actually quite safe to assume we can attack. Now, if we are lo losing ships, uh, which is fine, but we're going to be replacing them with uh, pyramids. So we can actually buy those pyramids, actually build those pyramids. Uh, research you, research you, research you, research you. I had to click all of them just to be on the safe side. Oh, wow. <laughs> Oh, nice, nice one. Um, Essek, um, Ekidik Founder. It appears that uh, the founder has developed an effective defensive mechanism through neural selection. Ah. Uh, yeah, well, that's fine. We don't care about colonization anyway. There we go. So, this one is now ours. For the moment. 11 population. And this construction ship is going to build a mega structure in here. And it's going to be the colony harvester. As for the rest, we don't care about it. Well, we don't. Will he be attacked? If he's, be, uh, if he's going to be attacked and he isn't, which is great. You want to be repaired, but we're going to be changing you as well. Let's put back the pyramid in here. Can we do that? No, because it has a ship size of 25. Holy shit. 
Yeah, we definitely need the other one. Okay, that's fine. Um, once we take this colony and our science vessel, construction ship, build mega colony harvesting. There we go. 20 minutes. So, guys, that's it for this episode. I hope you are enjoying yourself. Uh, next time we will harvest it. There, we will have harvested this uh, colony. As for now, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and uh, perhaps subscribe to the channel. And uh, I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.